Hello everyone, Spidey Fist here, and you are looking at Warframe on the Nintendo Switch in handheld mode. And this video is to show you what graphic settings I have. And the graphic settings I have, I believe, are some of the best options you can select. Uh, this is my personal preference. So if you weren't really sure of how to set up your preferences for your settings in Warframe on Nintendo Switch, I hope this video helps you. So without further ado, we're going to get right into it. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go down here to our options. Then we are going to go over to display right here at the top. And these are the settings that I have right now. Um, now, like things like the brightness, if you want to put the brightness down a little bit, if you, need, if you do need to turn on the colorblind uh, compensation, uh, you can do that, that right there. But here is what I have it set to uh, for colorblind compensation, none. Uh, so with that off, it doesn't really matter, uh, this right here. Uh, brightness at 65. If you do want to play with like a Warframe that has like primarily like white colors, I suggest maybe turning this brightness a little bit down because if not, whenever you step under light, it is going to be so bright and it is like, it's obnoxiously bright, okay? Uh, contrast, I've got a, just a solid 50. Field of view, 79, but if you want to rank that up a little bit more, you know, not a big deal. 79 is where I have mine. Uh, I have the screen shake turned off uh, because whenever you're aiming and doing stuff like that and the screen's shaking all over the place, especially if you're just like aiming from the hip and you're not like zoomed into a scope or anything like that, keep that off, especially if you have motion controls because you're going to be all over the place with those. Um, effects intensity, I've got it at a 103. Uh, local reflections, I've got them on. Volumetric lighting is on. Again, if you're playing with a like primarily white-based character, maybe turn that off so that way it doesn't glow so bad and it's not so obnoxious. Uh, film grain, I have off. Uh, ambient oculations or whatever that is. Oculus... Oculusion? I don't know. Occlusion. Occlusion? I'm going to stop trying to say it. Ambient that is on. GPU particles are high. And it says that you can turn it down to in, uh, improve your performance. But I haven't had any problems with performance uh, since putting these uh, on. With the exception of maybe like my network was bad and I kind of like started getting kind of jumpy. But aside from that, with high GPU, I'm still running the game and I'm still experiencing uh, no real problems with it. And the game looks good. Uh, depth of field is going to be on. Motion blur I have off. Uh, distortion on. Bloom on. Bloom intensity is at a 30. And then color correction and weapon elemental effect are on. And that will have your game looking like my game. And I am recording the handheld right here, so it will look a little bit better in person. But I hope this video helped you, and if it did, please like and subscribe, and be sure to turn on that notification bell, so that way you can see any videos I come out with in the future. Um, if you are new to Warframe, I am going to be putting up a video on like how to help you get through your first couple uh, levels of mastery and stuff like that, and what you need to know in order to uh, really get set up and going in the game. So be sure to tune in for that video if you need it, but that's it for this one. I'm Captain Spidey Fist, and I'm out of here.